And if all goes as planned on Thursday, the Mars rover Perseverance will be landing inside a crater. Meteorologist Anthony Anes explains why NASA engineers chose this specific spot. The sixth month journey from Earth to Mars comes to an exciting conclusion Thursday afternoon. The Mars rover Perseverance lands on the red planet at 12.55 Pacific time. Now I want to discuss the landing site. It's just north of the Mars equator at what's called the Jezero Crater. Now the rover is landing on a target that's nearly five miles wide. Now, one of the goals is to find signs of ancient microbial life. Now, here's why that site was chosen. This is an ancient river delta. I'm going to zoom in a little bit and see if you can see it. On Earth, these areas teem with life. Here's how Perseverance is going to look for that life. Now, the rover is the size of an SUV. It's 10 feet long, 9 feet wide, and 7 feet tall. When the rover gets into a good position, it's going to deploy this robotic arm. Now on that arm is a drill. There's also what's called the Watson and the Sherlock. The Sherlock houses a laser that'll break up the rocks in the hopes of finding direct evidence of past life. Pictures will be taken, video recorded, and samples will be collected. And something never heard before, the planet. Microphones will record audio of the work. Really remarkable, and you can watch that landing live on NBCLA.com and the NBCLA app when it happens this Thursday. It's set for 12.55 in the afternoon.